morning everybody, friends and followers of GNS uh, Mentoring Network. So this is Daniel and Louis uh, working on our project. So today is day number 35 after planting of our first experiment. So what we're doing today, we are collecting nodules. Yes, so nodules are very important for because they house the bacteria that are responsible for biological uh, nitrogen fixation. So the, the method that we are using to, to collect nodules is non-destructive because we want to because we want to preserve uh, the plants so that we can observe objective three, which is to monitor or, or evaluate the, the effect of nodulation on the productivity of the plant. Yes, so today we are harvesting nodules from one variety which is uh, Cap Blanket KB our treatment too. Okay, so, so that's the one that we are harvesting from. And then we we are we've targeted uh Cap Blanket because it has it started flowering. Yes, so Cap Blanket starts uh, flowering from day number twenty eight to thirty two. And then today is 35. So when the plant is flowering, we that's where we like assume that uh, uh, nitrogen fixation is at its peak. So that's more reason why we are harvesting nodules from the plants that have started flowering. And our another plant that has already started flowering, or another variety, is our lucupa. And then we collected some nodules already. So we are just going to demonstrate on how we collect the nodules from these plants. Okay. So, I'm trying to be as gentle as possible. As much as it injured. Okay, so we're doing continued nodule collection. We are now on uh, port number number what? Mm. Port number ten, replica four for Kablangit. That's what we're trying to collect huh? some nodules. <sighs> so yeah, we seem to be digging really deep. Huh? We assume that. Uh, the roots have gone way below the port, and that's why at the surface, yeah, but they're small. They're there and they're quite small. So, I mean, though we could only confirm that if we use the destructive method. But, the, for this project, but since we want to conserve the other plants, I mean, the rest of the plants for objective three, yeah, we'll have to stick to. Yeah, just collecting by digging along the roots just a little bit. Okay guys, so from here when we collect these nodules, we are going to trick them into the media that we made. Yes. So that we can see the rhizobia begin to grow onto the meat. Yes, uh, I've managed to collect one node, though it's very small. I don't know if you can see. Mm -hmm. Like you, you even leave the plant there and put you yes. don't remove it. No, we don't remove it. And you, you collect from the ones that are flowering? Look at that. White flowers. Mm -hmm. So we want to, we want to, to, to preserve the plant so that we can also do our objective training. 